The Lord is in this place tonight. The Lord is in this place tonight. Glory be to God. Let's give the Lord a hand clap of praise. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Glory, 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 glory. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Let's take a look at that song again. I will bless the Lord, O oh my Lord, and all that is within me, bless His Jesus' name. 
right. and that people will see the glorious gospel yes, yes, of Jesus God. Christ. Father, uh, we thank you, Lord, that the brass ceiling is broken now in Jesus' name. Father, uh, we thank you, Lord, for the wind of your spirit blowing strongly, blowing souls into the kingdom here in this community. Father, I thank you for the thousands that come in. Father, I thank you, Lord, for the move of God. I thank you, Lord, for the work of the Holy Spirit. Yes, Lord. Father, I thank you, Lord, for your love being poured out. Mm -hmm. Father, I thank you, Lord, for your word going forth unhindered, yes. unchecked yes. by any satanic device or force. Amen. In Jesus' Amen. name. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for families being blessed. Yes, Homes being blessed. Yes, Ministries being blessed. Yes, Father, that wayward child coming back home. Father, that one that's been addicted to drugs coming in. Yes. Father, I thank you, Lord, for that one, Father, that wants to give their life up. I thank you, Lord. That chain is broken yes, Lord. in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Father, we give you the praise. Thank you, thank Amen. you Father. Amen. We give you the glory. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. And we give you the honor. Yes, Lord God. Amen. For it's in Jesus' in name Jesus. we pray. Amen. Let the church say, Amen. 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 Let the Lord have hands on the faith. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Giving honor to God, the Lord Jesus Christ, and to the Holy Spirit. Amen. Giving honor to the chief. Uh, Chief Pastor that's in this community. Amen. Pastor Brown. He's our he's like a spiritual father to us, all pastors. I mean when I first came to Beyonce, and even before I got to Beyonce, Pastor Brown know I was calling him. Amen. And he's been like a mentor to me. And so I give honor to Pastor Brown. It's a Lovely wife, amen, and to this great ministry. Thank you, sir, for your liberal love in this community, sir. Thank you for all the questions for fear that you have poured out over years that you would come in first and begin to break up the fallow ground. Amen. You were a trailblazer here. You are a trailblazer here. And we honor you, sir. Praise God. Amen. 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 Glory be to God. To all the other clergy in the house. Amen. Amen. I could name every pastor that's here. Apostle Lopez and Prophetess Lopez, Bishop Green, uh, I'm going to say Pastor O.J. <laughs> <laughs> Pastor Cliff. Amen. Amen. Pastor Williams and Mother Williams, thank you all. Amen. Did I miss any clergy in the house? tonight. Amen. I want to honor you tonight because what we've been called to do is only by the grace of God that we can do it. Amen. When he said, who would go for us? We said, Lord, here am I. Send me. Amen. That's what we did. And so that's the highest calling there is. Amen. Giving honor and glory to God for my beautiful wife, Felicia, Amen. and my daughter, Desiree, Amen. and our son, the way to uh, We send greetings from Christ is Life International Church here in the wonderful city of Piante, South Korea. Amen. Amen. Uh, we've been here for a little while. <laughs> So we just want to say thank you so much, Pastor Brown, to all the pastors who have uh, invited us to come out and to minister the Word of God. And I thank God for Pastor Cliff especially, Amen. because Pastor Cliff, it was in Pastor That's Cliff's right. heart right. to, to begin this community revival. Amen. 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 So thank you, Pastor Cliff. Amen. Amen. I thank God for the unity and the love. Mm that has been shown and is being shown 
right now. Amen. 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 Glory be to God. To the congregants, to everyone in the sanctuary tonight, and to those who are watching by way of internet, we want to say thank you so much for being a part of the community-wide revival. We believe that God has a word for all of us on this evening. Amen. And as all the pastors come throughout the rest of this week, the word and everything's going to go higher. Yeah. So you don't want to miss a single night. Yeah. Yeah. Tell you, it's only getting better from here. Amen. 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 It's only getting better from here. Amen. Amen. Glory be to God. You may have your seat. Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory be to God. Holy Spirit, sir, have your way. Amen. Holy Glory Spirit. be to God. Amen. You know, when I got this assignment from the Lord, and I began to seek the Lord for the word of God that he wanted ministered on this evening. Uh, I began to think about all that we have been going through. Mm. Uh, we've been in this global pandemic for oh, almost two years long, three years. Mm. And, and a lot of things have occurred. And a lot of things have changed. We've had to make many, many adjustments since the global pandemic began. And one of the adjustments we're making even now is that uh, we can't come to the sanctuary as we want to. Mm -hmm. Amen. We have restrictions. Amen. And, and I began to think about that, and the Lord began to share with me what I should minister on tonight. Amen. Uh, please turn your Bibles to Isaiah, mm -hmm. the 44th chapter, and we're going to pick it up from the second, and we're going to read the third verse. Amen. Mm -hmm. Glory be to God. The scripture reads, Thus says the Lord who made you, and form you from the womb, mm -hmm. who will help you. Fear not, uh -huh. O Jacob, my servant, and you, but just wrong, whom I have chosen. For I will pour water on him who is thirsty, yeah. and floods on the dry ground. Right. I will pour my spirit on your descendants and my blessing on your offspring. Amen. The theme for this community-wide revival is showers of blessing. Showers of blessing. Amen. Amen. And what the Lord spoke to me, and I was like, Lord, you want me to minister on this? With everything that's going on, you want to minister on this subject, Lord? And God said, this is what I'm telling you to minister tonight. Mm. I don't know who this is for. I know it's for me. And I believe it's for many people in the room and those that are watching by way of the Internet. What God told me to minister on tonight is God can and God will do it again. Amen. Amen. God can and God will do it again. Somebody said, the man of God, we're in a global pandemic. We've had to go through so many changes. Uh, will life remain the way that it is right now? My friend, what God told me to tell you is that whatever you have experienced in the past that God did for you, and it seemed like it had a, a drop off, it seemed like it not working out. God told me to tell you that God can mm -hmm. and God will yes, yes. do it again. Yes. God can and God will do it again. You say, man of God, but what about the move of God? I want to move a God in my community. I want to move a God in my nation. I know they had a move in Azusa Street. I know there was a Welsh revival. Uh, I, I know that uh, there was a Brownsville revival. I, I know there was a Toronto blessing. 
But Lord, can you do it again? Yes, yes. And God is saying tonight, yes, I can. And I will do it again. And all he's looking for us to do is to stay thirsty. Yes, yes. And if we would just say, Lord, I'm hungry for more. Lord, I want more. Lord, I got to have more. God would say, I'm pouring out the blessing on you once again. God can and He will. Yes, He will. Do it again. Somebody says, but can He? Can He do it again? Yes, He can. Oh, yes, He can. Because we're talking about God Almighty. The maker of heaven and the maker of earth. The one that spoke and it came to pass. Yes, yes. There's nothing too hard nothing, sir. for the Lord. Yes. I don't know what your situation is. I don't know what your challenges are. I don't know what the problems you're facing are. But God sent me today to tell you that he can do it again. Yes, yes, yes. My God. Somebody is sitting there sick bed today. And you're thinking, can I get up from this sick bed? Can I recover from this? Wow. Can I get my strength back? Can I get my joy back? Can I get my peace back? Yes. Can I get my right mind back? Yes. God said he can do it again. Yes. Yes. And he will yes. do it again. Yes, he will. We're thinking about right now all that we've been through. But God is saying today, after all that you've been through, God is going to give you a fresh wind, yes. a second touch. He's going to move mighty on your life like never before. Yes. All he wants you to know is that he can do it again. Yes, he can. Amen. Yes, he can. He can do it again. Somebody sitting in a situation where they're thinking, I can't recover because I got my job and lost. I don't have any money. I don't have no way to come and take care of my family. But God said, put your trust, put your confidence in me. I can and I will do it again. Yes, yes. 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 Somebody's looking at their situation. They got a loved one that's out there strong on drugs. And you're saying to yourself, but this is the second time. Mm. Okay, there was rehab before, but now they're back out there again. But God sent me to tell you that God can and God will yes, do it again. Amen. He will bring you out. He will bring you out of that situation that you think you can't get out of. For that one that thinks they've done so many things wrong in their lives, and they think that God doesn't love them, God sent me to tell you that He can yes. and he will, yes, he will do it again. Yes. He will bring you out. Yes, Amen. Sir. Amen. He will bring you out. Today we're living in a world where we've been overwhelmed mm. with everything that has gone on around us. Uh, some of us have thought that maybe God went to retirement. That maybe God went on vacation. Some of us have thought that maybe God had sat down and tell, took a nap. But what God sent me to tell you today, that he's not napping. He's not on vacation. Uh, he's not on retirement. God sent me to tell you that he can and he will do it again. I don't know what you're dealing with. I don't know what you're going through. But God is saying today, if you will believe it, if you receive it, God can restore everything that the devil has stolen from you. That's in the word of God. That's Joel 2.25. God is saying today, we've got to get up and say, your Lord. I need you. Mm. Lord, I want you. Lord, pour out your spirit. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Glory be to God. Amen. We're talking about showers of blessings right, in this revival. Right. God is going to pour out his spirit on us. Amen. And it's only when we are so attentive, so eager, so thirsty, so hungry for more of God that we will say, Lord, I'm here. Me, you, Lord, pour out your spirit on me. 
But see what right now what we're going through is a, a time where we we've been we've been in this thing for a long time and, and and some of us have gotten tired, some of us have gotten fatigued, some of us are being worn down a little bit, and, and it's like you're on a marathon run. Mm. You know, on that marathon run, uh, you're running, you're running, running, getting fatigued, and all of a sudden, somebody right up inside you and pours some water in your head. You feel refreshed. Yes. You feel rejuvenated, yes. and you can run some more. God is saying today, he's about to pour out. Yes. Amen. He's about to pour out. Amen. He's pouring out now. Yes. This revival is the beginning of God pouring out. Yes. In our community. Somebody said, but this is beyond that. This place is steeped with tradition. This place has a history where it wasn't no move of God here. But God is saying, I can do a new thing. Yeah. Yeah. I can do a new thing. I can do a new thing right here in beyond that. Yeah. Yeah. Is there anything too hard for God? Nothing. God is saying today, I'm pouring out. Yes. I'm pouring out. All I want you to do is take your eyes off your problems. That's right. Take your eyes off your situation. Yes. Take your eyes off your circumstances. Yes. And say, Lord, here I am. Yes. God is saying today, he's pouring out. God can and he will. Yes. Do it again. Yes, it will. We hear about the move of God in the past. Mm -hmm. How God moved in Azusa Street. Yes. How God moved in the Welsh Revival. Right. How God moved in the World Faith Movement. How God moved in the Healing Movement. But God is saying, that was then. <laughs> this is now. Right. Amen. And for your trouble, yes. you shall receive double. God is saying, Why not just 
throw in the towel. Why don't I just say enough is enough. I can't take no more. No. God is still God. Yes, he is. Somebody need to know that today. Yes, they do. Somebody need to know that God is still God. And he reigns on the throne. Yes. Whatever you're going through today, God is saying today, it's not too much for him. That's right, sir. It's not too much for him. God promised in Isaiah 44, uh, verse 2, Thus says the Lord who made you and formed you from your womb, who will help you. God is saying, I will help you. My friend, we got the help of the Holy Spirit. That's right, sir. He is resident on the inside of us. Help us and assist us and to bring us out. But we got to say, yes, Lord. Yes. I know it seems like we should run this way, run that way, and think about all the other ways we can come out. But God said tonight, he wants you to know he can and he will do it again in your yes, life. He will. Amen. Yes, he will. In your life. Glory be to God. Amen. Glory be to God. He will do it again. Yes, he will. He will do it again. He said, he said, fear not. Yes, sir. Glory be to God. There's a lot of fear. Mm-hmm. There is a lot of fear that's in this world today. Mm-hmm. Now, now, we ought to have wisdom. We ought to use wisdom at all times. Mm-hmm. We have to be led by the Spirit of God. Right. Yeah. But God has not given us a spirit of fear, but a power of love and a sound mind. Mm-hmm. Glory be to God. So we, we can't allow fear to dominate us. That's right. Amen. I know that it seems like we should go home and pull our heads under the blanket and not get up. But God is saying, I got too much for you to do. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got a plan. I got a purpose for your life. Yeah. And I don't want you just to sit down and, and wallow in fear. I want you to get up. Yeah. I want you to get up and I want you to come and stand under my shower of the blessing. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. Take that idea of fresh drink tonight. Amen. 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 I know somebody said, but uh, I got a touch last year. Mm. <laughs> but God is saying it's time for a fresh touch. Amen. God is saying it's time to have a, a Fresh outpouring of the Spirit. Yes, yes. yes, sir. Glory be to God. Somebody said, but I, I went to the altar 25 years ago. <laughs> and God said, I, I need to come back. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. Hey, maybe I need a refill. Need a refill. <laughs> this, this, this revival is about to get no refill. Yes. Amen. Amen. Get no refill. Right. Somebody said, but, but man of God, uh, I thought I couldn't get any more. But going to God is going to the fountain that can never run dry. Right. Right. Amen. Tell you, you got more than enough. Yeah, Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Tell you that you can be greedy for yours. <laughs> I mean, God got so much, He wants you to be Say, I want, I want, I want, I want. Amen. He don't care how many people say they want. As a matter of fact, it makes them happier when more come. That's right. Amen. Amen. That's right. Because if you don't dip his, his, his reservoir at all. Amen. 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 God can pour his spirit on the whole world and not even blink. That's right. Amen. Mm-hmm. No power train on him. It's more than enough. Amen. No power train on him. Hmm. I mean, he can sweep this world over with a mighty wave of the Spirit, and, and he can do it again. Mm-hmm. He wants to do it again. Yes, but maybe we've been preoccupied. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's good. Mm. good maybe we've been preoccupied with looking at everything that's going on around us mm-hmm. and saying, Whoa, is a minute. God can't do it in this type of situation. Hmm. My friend, there isn't a situation mm-hmm. where God can't come through. Amen. 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 
Glory be to God. Jesus was in the very pits of hell. Satan, death, and hell were trying to hold him down. And Jesus said, you can't hold me down. I reign even in hell. Amen. All the demon forces were aligned. They were trying to hold him down. We can't let him get up. We can't let him get up. We can't let him get up. He said, oh, I come. Amen. With all power. Amen. And guess what, child of God? That same power is resident in your body. Think about it. Think about the same power that raised Jesus from the grave. God is wanting to release that power again in his church. He wants us to uh, uh, go, go to the place where the early apostles were, where they were yes, walking around, yes, and Peter, he was walking around, and all of a sudden, what? People were getting healed. What? <laughs> His shadow was falling, and he was just getting up. God said, mm. he can. That's right. Mm -hmm. And he will That's mm. right. do it again. Amen. Amen. The question is, who will he do it? That's it, right there. See, God is still saying, I'm looking for a man, a woman as well, to stand in the gap, to make up the hedge so that I don't have to destroy the land. But God is saying, who will go for us? Because God doesn't have a body. The body of our Lord Jesus Christ is seated. Mm -hmm. That resurrected body yes, sir. is seated yes, sir. on the right yes, hand of God. Mm -hmm. But God is still here. Mm -hmm. He's here by His Spirit. Yes, he is. And His Spirit dwells in a temple made with clay. No, sir. An earthen vessel. Yes, mm -hmm. And God is saying today, He's wanted to do it again, but He needs somebody. Mm -hmm. He needs somebody to do it again through. That's right, sir. And He's asking for you. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. He's asking for every born again believer yeah. to, to ignite the fire oh, of God that is resident on the inside mm -hmm. and become a burning lamp and a burning torch for God. Yes. Oh, Amen. Because there are some people who just think that God can't do it again. Mm -hmm. The question is, will you go? Mm -hmm. Amen. We're talking about revival. See, uh, tonight is about stirring up the embers of your heart. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. There are embers that have uh, maybe uh, been covered with ash. Not say they have been extinguished, but it just means that you're a fresh wind. To blow across those embers. Mm -hmm. To ignite the fire of God within you. Mm -hmm. To go about doing God's business. Amen. Mm -hmm. Amen. Because someone needs to know that although they might find themselves in a wallet in a pig's pen, like the prodigal son, mm -hmm. he had used all his father's money, wasted it on rides and living. And somehow, some way, the word came to his heart. He remembered. Mm -hmm. He remembered the love of his father. Yes. 
somebody somewhere today, you 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 backslidden, you got away from God, and God is saying tonight through this word, it's time to come home again. Yes, sir. Yeah. 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 It's time to come home again. See that prodigal son, he he's like many of us. Uh, we we have gotten out of here and we've done our thing and we've forgotten where we came from. But God is in tonight. It's time to come back home again. It's time to remember what the Lord has done for you. Yes. Yes. Amen. It's time to go back home and, and remember that God loves you and God can and God will do it again. He'll do it again in your life. That prodigal son in Luke 15, he thought in his mind, it can't work. It can't work. My father can't love me that much. He thought, after all I've done, after all my wicked ways, how could my father still love me? Mm -hmm. Somebody, I don't know if you're in this room or not, mm. maybe you're on the internet, but you're asking yourself the same question. Mm -hmm. After all I've done, mm -hmm. can God mm -hmm. still love me? Hey, nigga, it's all about the love. All about the love. It's all about God's love. Amen. That prodigal son, after all he went through, after losing everything, after having set back, after set back, after set back, he began to think that it, it can't happen for me again. I, I can't get back to where I was before. I can't have my father's love anymore. But my friend God has sent me to tell you, he can. Yes, right. yes. Amen. And he, he will, will do it again. Yes, he will. Yeah. He'll do it again. That young man came to the senses one day. He was perplexed. He was going through. But one day he came to the senses. He said, my father mm -hmm. has many, many Mm. My father, he 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 may accept me back in. I'm gonna go home to my father. Mm -hmm. Friend, God has sent me to tell you that he can and he will do it again. If you have walked away from Jesus Christ, God has sent me to tell you. He can't restore you. Yes, he can. Mm -hmm. And maybe you're out there today and you have not even given your life to Jesus Christ. You have not even received him as your Lord and Savior. And you're saying, with all that's happened in my life, uh, I don't believe that someone can love me that much. Mm -hmm. I've been sent by God to declare to you that not only does he love you, he died for you. Come yes, on. yes. Amen. 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 He died for you. Way back on Calvary. And he wants you to know that if he paid that price for you, and if he saved others, who have been through situations and changes in their life and upheavals and everything went wrong. Mm. He can do it again yes, yes. in your life. For that uh, wife that uh, her husband has left her with her children and, and she don't know what to do. Mm. And she's saying to herself, I don't know how I'm going to make it. God is saying to you today that he can and he will do it again for you. Mm. He'll make a way out of no way for you. Yes, he will. But for that person that's been hurt in that relationship and because you've been hurt 
and because you've been rejected and you don't want to keep on living, God is saying today that don't do that because he will do greater things in your life and he'll give you greater love than what you thought you lost. Amen. Don't, don't allow the devil to do that to you. Amen. For that husband who seemingly can't get away from uh, doing things you know he's not supposed to do. Mm. Living out of his covenant. Not living right. Not doing right. And you say, I want to stop, but I don't have no power to stop. Mm. God is saying today, there is power yeah. that can restore you, yeah. can bring you back, and can cause you to be delivered today. And that power is in Jesus Christ. Amen. Right. Amen. Amen. God can. Yes. And God yes. will. Yes. Amen. Amen. Do it again. Mm. You know, some somebody today, you're thinking to yourself, this is too good to be true. And it is, but it's true. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. The Bible says, for God so loved the world yes. Amen. that he gave his only begotten son so that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Mm -hmm. If God saved anyone, mm -hmm. God can save you. Mm -hmm. Amen? Mm -hmm. He can and he will mm -hmm. do it again. Mm -hmm. Somebody said, but man of God, this is like the seventh or eighth time I made the same mistake. Mm -hmm. I'm no good. Don't say that. Mm -hmm. Don't say that. You're the most valuable thing, the most valuable thing, the most valuable person that God has ever created. Mm -hmm. Amen. Amen. You say, but the devil's always on my back. All these temptations, all these trials, why is it happening to me? Because mm -hmm. God wants you. That's right. That's, That's right. right. That's right. Say it. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Yeah. God has a purpose. God has a plan for your life. Mm. And God is saying today, don't let the devil steal your joy. Amen. 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 It's time to come home again. That's right. It's time to come home again. That prodigal son, he, he thought to himself, he said, look, look at me. This isn't me. That's right. Mm -hmm. That's right. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get up from here. Yeah. And I'm going to go to the Father's house. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's right. My friend, that is what God is offering you today. Mm -hmm. God is saying, it's time now to get up mm -hmm. and to come to the Father's house. That's right. Mm -hmm. Wherever you are around the world. In this room, all over the city of Keontae, God is saying, it's time to come to the Father's house again. It's time to come home. Mm -hmm. If you have walked away from God, if you don't know Jesus Christ, today is your day yes, yes. of salvation. Amen. Amen. Today is your day yeah. of healing. Yeah. Today is your day of deliverance. Amen. 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 Glory be to God. Amen. We're standing to our feet. Let's give the Lord a hand clap. For everyone that is in this room, for everyone that's viewing by way of the internet right now, wherever you are, the Holy Spirit, He is moving. He is convicting hearts. He is wooing hearts. He is drawing men unto Jesus Christ. And today, if you want to make a quality decision to make Jesus Christ the Lord and Savior of your life, 
where you are, and if you're in this room, and you say, Lord, I want to come home, just signify by raising your hand. For those of you that are viewing this, this revival by way of the internet, wherever you are, if, if you want to uh, give your life to Jesus Christ, he loves you. All I want you to do is say these words after me and mean it from your heart. Lord Jesus, I come to you as humble as I know how, recognizing that I'm lost, recognizing I have need of a Savior. Lord Jesus, I believe you died on Calvary's cross over 2,000 years ago for my sins. And that God raised you up from the dead after three days with all power in your hand. Lord Jesus, I receive you now as my Lord and as my Savior. Satan, I don't belong to you. Jesus Christ is my Lord. Thank you, Lord. I'm born again. Thank you, Lord. My name is written in the Lamb's Book of Life, and I belong to Jesus Christ. If you prayed that prayer with us, you are born again. Amen. Amen. Maybe you have walked away from God and you said, I want to come back home. I want to come back to the Father's house. If that's you today, pray this prayer after me. Lord Jesus, I come to you recognizing that I turned my back on you. I walked away from you. But Lord Jesus, I repent. And Lord, I want to come home. Lord Jesus, I know you love me. You died on the cross for me, and you got up on the third day with all power. Lord Jesus, receive me back home again. Forgive me of all my sins. Wash me in the blood of the Lamb. Lord Jesus, I'm coming home. I'm coming to the Father's house. Thank you, Lord, for receiving me in Jesus' name. Glory be to God. Maybe there's some tonight. You said, man of God, I want that fresh outpouring of the Spirit. I want another touch from God. If that's you tonight, Pray this prayer after me. Lord Jesus, I know that you are the baptizer in the Holy Ghost and fire. Lord Jesus, I want, I need, I hunger, I thirst for a fresh outpouring of your spirit on my life. Now! 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 Thank you, Lord, for filling me afresh and filling me anew. Everybody shout, Hallelujah! 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 Glory to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. We give you praise. Yes, Lord. We give you honor, Lord. Yes, Lord. And we give you glory, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 
Now maybe there's someone in this room or someone watching by way of the internet that you need healing in your body. Place your hand on your body in the area you need healing. We're going to believe God tonight. Let his healing power go forth and touch you and heal you where you are. There's no distance with God's spirit. Whether you're here in this room or whether you're watching by way of the internet, God's healing presence yeah. is coming to you now. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Glory be to God. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we touch and agree with these yeah. your saints in this room. Yeah. And those who are watching by way of the internet. Father, we take authority over every yes. sickness, every disease, yeah. every spirit of infirmity. We command it. Go yeah. in Jesus' name. Thank Blind you. eyes open. Deaf ears open, lame cripple, rise and walk, yeah. cancers, tumors, dry up, die, dissolve, go now in Jesus' name. By the stripes of Jesus Christ, be healed, be set free in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. Let's give the Lord a hand clap of praise. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Glory be to God. Glory be to God. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. said showers of blessings yeah, are pouring yeah. out. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name. Thank you, I have a couple of announcements for you, amen, before we let you go. Come on, get your seed in your hand as we prepare to take our offering on tonight. Amen. Those online, amen, you also have an opportunity to give. If you follow the slide information that should be posted out there online to you, I'm saying to you, don't just eat. Plant a seed. God is blessing. All the proceeds of the community revival are going back into the community revival of the community alliance of churches. All these funds will be used for the work that we do together. All the churches. This is not going in anybody's pockets. Amen. It's for the alliance itself. So come on, plant a seed and be a blessing to the work of God that he is doing in this community. In Jesus' name. Bring it down just a little bit, my brother. Amen. Amen. While we're still taking up the offering, amen. Two announcements. This Friday night, all seven churches, amen, and all those that would like to be involved with the communion, the Lord's Supper, uh, receiving the Lord's Supper together, unified. All churches will be here, amen, on Friday. If you're not able to be here and you would like to receive your elements uh, virtual at your home, please uh, contact Pastor Brown. He will be here at the church up till Friday, 10 a.m. to 12 noon, amen. If you need to reach out to him, myself, amen, please contact us as soon as possible to get your elements in your hands so we can commune together in Jesus' name. Friday, immediately following the preach word uh, on that night. Amen? Amen. Let's receive our offering. Come on, stretch your hand towards your seed. Father, we thank you for the seed of God that has been planted in this house. You know the word of God that you've called us to do. And Father, you have blessed this seed already. We thank you, God, for the opportunity to plant seed into kingdom ground. And we know, Father God, it will be blessed and it will reap the promised blessing of your word. You will touch the hearts of men and God, they will give unto our bosom. 
in Jesus' name. Press down, shaking together, running over, in Jesus' mighty name. We thank you, bless the giver, Father God, as we bless and honor you for being the gifter of everything, in Jesus' name. Somebody say amen. 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 Hands together for Pastor Donald Brown. Amen. Our host. Amen. As you come. Amen. For our benediction. Amen. Amen. What a word. What a word. Amen. We thank you. Praise God for Pastor Armand bringing it tonight. And we're just looking for God to take us higher and higher. Night by night. We're looking at Pastor X who comes in on tomorrow night. Be praying for him. Amen. Be praying that God will use him in a mighty way. And again, we thank and praise all that are here tonight for all that are tuning in online right now. We thank God for each one of you. Just continue to share this word with others in the community. Because they can come out and be a part of what God is doing. Yes. And we just thank you and praise him for being God Almighty. Thank him again for the word. Yes, so amen. God can and God yes, will. Amen. Do it again. Yes, it Hallelujah. Nothing that he can't do. That's right. So if you need to put your faith with trust and belief in him, he's able to deliver. He's able to set us free. Yes. Amen. Just bow heads for a word of prayer. Father God, again, we come before you tonight. We thank you and we praise you, oh God, for all that you have done, for all that you are doing, and for all that you shall do, God, on our behalf. We just ask right now, God, to refill Pastor Ahmed and he's yes. out, oh God, into the community tonight. We ask you to pray, God, for a refill, a fresh anointing to fall upon him, oh God, from the top of his head to the very soles of his feet, God. And again, we just pray right now, God, for Pastor Exley, and he can come on tomorrow night, God. Father, to take us to higher heights in you, God. Father, we thank you right now. We speak it to be so in the name of Jesus. God, have your way. And Father, we pray that even as we prepare to leave this place, we never from your presence. Watch over us, oh God, as we travel on the roads, God. Take us to our various homes of God. Give us a peaceful sleep tonight, God. And if be your will, God, quicken us our spirit to rise up in the morning, God. To give you glory, honor, and praise. Yeah. Father God, just have your way in our lives. Yeah. Now, Father, as we prepare to close out, God, just ask and pray. Father, continue to move by your spirit throughout the course of the night. Father God, that we continue to look to you, the author and the finisher of our faith. Now, may the grace of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, rest, rule, and abide, his forth and forevermore. And the church said, Amen. 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 Be blessed because you are blessed. Amen. Amen.